Hey everybody, this is Josh here, AKA Bearded Fat Loss, and today I wanted to cover three healthy foods that you probably should avoid on your weight loss journey. Alright, before I start this video, I wanted to make the disclaimer, you know, I don't think any of these foods are necessarily bad, but I think they have a lot more calories than some people realize, and I think there are a lot better alternatives out there specifically for weight loss. All right, so the first thing I wanted to talk about is peanuts or nuts in general. Very, very high in calories. They're super delicious, but very, very high in calories. So you have one serving there is 150 calories. This is a serving. This little measly cup full here is all that you get. And with 150 calories, there are so many better options out there that are gonna give you a lot more volume, things that'll take a lot more time to eat, things that'll be a little more satiating. It's a whole plate full of baby carrots. That whole plate full is the same amount of calories as this little thing of peanuts. Just look at the difference. Yeah, it's ridiculous how different. You could eat 10 servings worth of peanuts to get that same volume from carrots. And the only reason I mention any of those honey roasted peanuts are one of my favorite snacks. I usually don't keep them around or buy them that often because it is so easy to eat two, three, four, five, six servings of these in minutes. And just like that, you have a thousand calories gone for the day. You know, so I think foods like this that are just so dense in calories are really, really tough when you're dieting. All right, so the next food I wanted to cover is dried fruit. You know, dried fruit is nice and healthy. It's gonna give you a lot of micronutrients, but the calories, I <laughs> just dropped two of them, but the calories are very, very dense. So this is a whole apricot condensed down to this little baby, small bite-sized piece. These four apricots on the plate here are gonna be the same calories as a whole apple. Just look at the difference there. Again, just so much more volume with the apple. So when you dehydrate fruit, it condenses a whole fruit's worth of sugars down to this tiny bite. So it's so easy, again, to have just an absurd amount of calories eating you know, what's considered a healthy snack. So something to keep in mind there, if you're shopping around for snacks, you know, go with fresh fruit or vegetables instead of the dried fruit. You're gonna get a lot more bang for your buck. The last and probably worst culprit of everything I've been talking about today, you know, fruit smoothie, fruit juice drinks that you see in the refrigerated section at the grocery store. This little tiny container of juice is 240 calories. Do you know what you could eat with 240 calories compared to this one little drink? Yeah, you would be able to eat this whole plate of carrots and an apple. Think about how much food that is. I mean, that is a heaping pile of carrots and an apple for the same amount of calories. And you might even be saying, you know, I don't wanna eat carrots or apples or things like that. For 240 calories, you could eat a chocolate peanut butter cookie if you wanted to, or you could eat all of those things. So many foods out at the grocery store are gonna have way better options for way less calories. Uh, and I remember when I was first starting my weight loss, some of those things, you know, of course they're healthy. I can have those as snacks, that's gonna be fine. You know, eating five, six, seven, eight hundred calorie snacks and not even realizing it. So, you know, making those couple of switches or transitions are gonna help significantly when it comes to losing weight. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, make sure to give it a like. Uh, leave a comment below if you have any other, you know, if you have any other foods that are culprits of this. I know I had, I had a few others, but I wanted to keep the video nice and short for you. And as always, be sure to subscribe if you wanna see more videos. I'd be more than happy to help you guys on your weight loss journeys. But until next time, I will talk to you all later. Have a good one.